against interpretation, Susan Sontag, this is from the first chapter, number six. It doesn't matter whether artists intend or do not intend for their works to be interpreted. Perhaps Tennessee Williams thinks Streetcar is about what Kazan thinks it to be about. It may be that Cocteau in The Blood of a Poet and in Orpheus wanted the elaborate readings which have been given these films. In terms of Freudian symbolism and social critique, but the merit of these works certainly lies elsewhere than in their meanings. Indeed, it is precisely to the extent that Williams' plays and Cocteau's films do suggest these portentous meanings that they are defective, false, contrived, lacking in conviction. From interviews, it appears that Resne and Rob Grill consciously designed last year at Marienbad to accommodate a multiplicity of equally plausible interpretations. But the temptation to interpret Marienbad should be resisted. What matters in Marienbad is the pure, untranslatable, sensuous immediacy of some of its images and its rigorous, if narrow, solutions to certain problems of cinematic form. Again, Igman Bergman may have meant the tank rumbling down the empty night street in the silence as a phallic symbol. But if he did, it was a foolish thought. Never trust the teller, trust the tale, said Lawrence. Taken as a brute object, as an immediate sensory equivalent for the mysterious abrupt armor happenings going on inside the hotel, that sequence with the tank is the most striking moment in the film. Those who reach for a Freudian interpretation of the tank are only expressing their lack of response to what is there on the screen. It is always the case that interpretation of this type indicates a dissatisfaction, conscious or unconscious, with the work, a wish to replace it by something else. Interpretation based on the highly dubious theory that a work of art is composed of items of content violates art. It makes art into an article of use for arrangement into a mental scheme of categories. So I ask myself, does art task or mission is to change, to change me, to change the human being? According to Susan Sontag, maybe it isn't, and I tend to think the same. I used to think that art helps, helps the world to be a better place that art can change a human being, but it is not true. It depends in how each individual thinks of life and acts according it. Well, we will continue talking with and reading this wonderful book.